Courtney from Gray House Studio. Today we're going to show you how to turn any ceramic pot into the perfect plant home with adequate drainage by drilling a hole in the bottom with a ceramic drill bit. With this skill you can turn pretty much anything into a plant home, including mugs with saucers or like we did with our succulent display using this appetizer dish with the little cute ceramic cups. Really the sky's the limit with what you can create. You only need a few tools to make this happen. We're using a corded drill, you could use a battery powered drill, and a ceramic drill bit. This one's 5 sixteenths. You also, of course, need your safety gear, which includes safety glasses and ear protection. And, of course, your ceramic pot. To get started, we'll need to put on our safety gear. When drilling a hole into a ceramic pot, start with a firm amount of pressure, pushing the drill down on the pot until the drill bit digs into the surface. Then ease up on the pressure as the bit makes its way through the pot. Use a consistent medium speed to avoid using a high speed and spinning the bit too fast. With your other hand, make sure you have a firm grasp on the pot to hold it in place. Now that we have a hole drilled in the bottom of our pot, we can add our plant and water it without worrying about the water building up in the pot. So another thing we like to do with ceramic vases is turn them into shades for some cool modern lamps that we're building. You can do this easily by using a hole saw. This is what the hole saw looks like. It's diamond coated on the tip and it's one and five eighths inch wide. We can just, once you drill the hole in the bottom, you can insert a lamp kit and screw the <laughs> screw the piece onto the inside. We got this lamp kit for five dollars at IKEA. Once it's tight, you can screw the light bulb in, and voila! Makes for a really cool yeah. pendant pendant light. Or you could mount it to something and make a desk lamp or a wall sconce. We found that using a ceramic drill bit is essential, whether it's making pots more functional or creating unique lighting pieces. If you found this video helpful, be sure to check out our other tutorial videos and subscribe to our channel to see more of our DIY projects.